it's just sad for me that like Bernie supporters got duped because like the it was being used not just as a fake way to resist Trump, but it was also yeah. being deliberately used to slow down Bernie and to prevent him from mm-hmm. ascending. Because what happened in 2016, the emails that were stolen that were blamed on Russia showed that, that the party was corrupt and they were biased against Bernie. And then that same wing lost. So like they were done. This was the perfect opportunity for Bernie and his movement to ascend and to pre- like present like a genuine working class um, candidate, you know, w- versus yeah. Trump, who was a fake working class candidate. He claimed to be there for the working people. But of course, that was a scam. So this was Bernie's moment. And he had no more reason to protect the Clinton wing because like, A, they lost and B, they tried to sabotage him. So what did Bernie do? He went along with the Russiagate narrative. He mm-hmm. introduced some measure to counter Russian interference. He speculated that Trump was doing Putin's bidding. He basically propped up the scam that the neoliberal wing of the party was being used to suppress him. And of course, what did that earn him on the eve of the Nevada caucus in 2020 yep. when like, he was doing well? They Russiagated Bernie. They like they had to, didn't they? they remember that like that that they asked him about it on the tarmac and stuff. Like it was like it was for a few days yeah. when it was useful. It to, to to you know the powers that be. They really hammered on like, well, are, do you, will you will you deny Russia your like? Will you tell Putin you don't want his help? <laughs> and I mean, and it I, it's it's a way of making someone grovel. Essentially, yeah, exactly. yeah, it fucking worked. Yeah. He went along with yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. 